Hey guys, welcome back to Drivy and Phoebe's Room! If you clicked on this video, you most likely watched the first video of our first travel vlog for our vacation here in Europe. So if you didn't watch that first travel vlog video, it will give you so much more content and knowledge of what we will be doing in the continuing videos. The link is down below! Okay, let's get back to the video. This was outside our hotel. Currently, we're in London. That's the exterior of our hotel. We went to a local Indian small restaurant for lunch. This delicious dosa it was very spicy. So we got this drink because our dosa was spicy. All right guys, so it's been very chaotic as you can like probably hear the background noise right now. But we had some lunch as you could see from the earlier clips. And as I voice over for you guys, hopefully in some sort of way, we're just walking outside the streets just to see if there's any other places that we could possibly, we could do before it is dinner time. Because we have that plan. Today is basically our free day before we have everything else. We have like a lot to do, to do and travel. Might possibly go to the mall, so. This was the underground station or something, if you guys can see. Since the mall was further away, we decided to go into this TK Maxx. Now in the US we have a TJ Maxx, but this is TK Maxx, so we were like, huh. So let's go inside and check it out. Here's the fragrance section and the electronics section. This TK Maxx is pretty big. Look at this dress, so cute. Or is that a top, you guys? I don't know. Seems like VD likes it. Honestly, have no clue why I recorded the sunscreen section. Many different options though. Here is the purses and bag aisle. They had so many options compared to bag at home. Which one would you guys pick? Comment down below. Here is a pretty nice DKNY bag. Super cute. Do you guys think VD likes it? I think she looks great. There are more similar DKNY bags. Now I would want all of these. These bags at the ground look like corn. Take a look at all these rows of clothes. There are endless options, you guys. Would you shop here? Comment down below. I spotted the jewelry section, so let's go over there. Whoops, I got it wrong. This is the food section. Let me try to find the jewelry section again. There we go. All right, so now we're in the TK Maxx and I saw some jewelry coming up, so I wanted to quickly look at some and it's really crowded. All right, it was very loud here. So I'm gonna take over by voiceovering. There were many collections of watches, bracelets, earrings, and rings. Look at the earring options, endless. Look at this cool ring I found. It's time to leave the store, you guys. So we purchased nothing because everything in there was like very overpriced but also we didn't find anything really good. We weren't here to go shopping but we were just here to see for the experience. We just wanted to spend some time looking around. Also if you're wondering where VD is during the VD and Drew Room channel, you know this video. VD's right here. She doesn't really have much to say because I, normally I say everything. Do you guys think Beauty should start saying stuff too? Like, I think, yeah. I think you should start narrating everything too. Yeah. Because normally I do all the editing, so therefore you hear me. So comment down below or like this video if you want Beauty to somehow voice over the videos sometimes. I think we might try that this time. Although we didn't go in a train, we did take a picture outside the train station. The reason we didn't go on the train to go to the mall is because the tickets were heavily overpriced. And we just thought it wasn't worth it spending that much money to go all the way just to a mall. After taking that picture, we went to Primark, Primark, whatever you like to call it. That store had a huge checkout line. Look here. So we went inside to see what was up because they had huge deals and sales. So we brought some souvenirs for our family members. We 
can officially say we gathered the goodies. So these are like really tall winding doors. So let's go through them. And you have to manually push. This is more clips of the hotel lobby. The hotel style is a mix of modern and old. After a few moments, I believe we went inside the hotel room to rest a little bit. Now here's where the fun begins. So this is a VIP bus, literally meaning that this bus is for exclusively famous people. As you can see there's Vidi. This bus had tables, chairs, it was like a dining hall. It also had a kitchen and a bathroom. We sure got the bus of luxury for the rest of the tour. So yay! Right, so as we're walking through these grand doors, Hold on guys, the clips may feel messed up, but they aren't because I didn't record anything else on the bus, unfortunately. But we did go on the bus, we went to an Indian restaurant, and we had some food, and unfortunately I didn't record it. Ugh, you guys. But the next clip is us trying to recap of what we did while going to a grocery store to grab some water. Alright, let's get back to the video. You guys know these beautiful doors. Um, either way, you need to get here. It's been a hectic, chaotic day. Yeah. So that's why we couldn't quite vlog. But when was the last time we left off? I'm not even sure. But we went back to our hotel after we decided to not go to the mall. And then we took a nap. Getting ready to go to this bus back there. And it's a really nice bus. And I think I filmed a little clip out of it. Famous people have been sitting in that. So I felt fancy. After that, we went to a good Indian restaurant and tasted really good, fresh. And how did you like the food? Um, it was good. I think I have some pictures. And if I don't, I'm super sorry that we didn't like film it. Now we're in a grocery store for some water. This grocery store saved our lives so many times here in London. In the US, we have something that's called Big Y. This store is exactly like it. And we bought a few other things from here the next couple of days. So this store has saved our lives and it was amazing. 10 out of 10. enough of trying to be a pianoist but here is some cinematic shots of the hotel lobby just for you guys okay guys so we just explored a little bit around the top of the hotel at the top floor and now we're gonna go down the stairs but let me show you really something really cool wondering why we just walked down all those stairs it's because we were trying to see the pool we were informed there was a pool here and we decided to explore this hotel and unfortunately this door that was supposed to lead to the pool was locked 
And then there was this really long hallway, as you can see, really creepy, but we walked down it. There was no entrance to the pool from there, so here is the pool view from the stairs. So take a good glimpse. It would actually be fun if we went swimming, but it's too cold in London to swim. But there you guys go. Now we have to walk all the way back up. Let's go. All right, guys, so now we are here back in the hotel. hotel. All right, guys, so now we're here back in the hotel, hotel. room after we, like, explored the hotel some more. Sorry, I keep smacking your face almost like... <laughs> so we did change into pajamas. Currently, the room is a little bit messy, so I'll clean it up for you guys and show you a little room tour. And... We're just gonna do the specialty like you guys know it. She's the best at it. But currently, she's gonna go brush her teeth. And meanwhile, I'll try to edit this video. See you during the room tour. Welcome to the hotel room. So, let's start with this hotel room tour thing. First, it's very European style. It's really big, it's really spacious. I think it's perfect size. It's also very different from like American hotel not rooms. Not too much. Not too like, much, but like mainly, like in some ways. I wanna quickly say something, that this room is for me and Vivi and another room my parents are sharing. So we have two rooms. And these are one of the few hotels we're going to be staying in, in London. Yeah. So, once you first walk in, you have your hotel card Hard key. You enter in, it's all dark. You have to put yeah. the key in so have in order for in the lights to function. Yeah. If you don't put the key in, you, you don't have lights. I think that's kind of smart. You walk in, and like the t doors are so tall. Yeah, they are, really. Especially the doorknobs, they're up to Vivi's chest <laughs> area. And like normally they're supposed to be by the waist area, so that's really confusing. This is the bathroom first yeah, so door. On your on my left side, there is a bathroom, so let's, let's go in. This bathroom is also very spacious, and it's also very European style. As you can tell, the sink is also European style. Like everything in this bathroom is mainly European style. From the sink, it's, it's very there. different from what we're yeah. used to. And I like how they give it a hand soap dispenser instead of bar soaps. Yeah, I like that a lot. So towels. Trash can. Yep. Tissue box. Glasses. A very large mirror to see Vivi in. And that's me, you guys. The tripod's back. So let's turn me back. Cut. Here we are. So this is where the toilet is. It is very different from the U.S. hotels and like toilets and stuff. U.S. hotels and U.S. Hotels and a different shape, and, kind yeah. of. And there's this whole like centerpiece that you might think a vase with flowers should go there. And honestly, I think it should. But well, can you guess what this is? Well, comment your answers below before I say it. I'll three, give you three seconds. Two, one. To flush your toilet. So when you press this down, your full toilet will flush. Full toilet will flush. Full toilet will flush. So this whole entire whatever masterpiece is just for this. And additionally, I just want to show you guys how like glittery the tiles yeah, are. It is. Hopefully the camera picks it up. It's like pink, blue, purple, orange. It looks purple. more orange. But it's so pretty. Yeah. Let me go to shower. Let me tell you first things first. Hazard, danger, hazard. Look at where Vivi's knee is compared to where the top of that thing is. It's like up to my big body. jump up into this bulky tub. And literally, uh, let me tell you a story, you guys. So, when this happened to me literally today, so I was hopping out of the shower. And I didn't expect such a deep, like, jump, drop, cliff. And therefore, I fell and slipped on this tile. <gasps> Yikes. And uh, she banged her head against the sink, she told me. <laughs> I'm good. It was just lightly. But, like, 
the fall was a little hard. So moving on, so there's like soap. And all. We're using our own soap though. Yeah, and this is also really unique. So this is a European type of style. Like, so the first shower. knob is to turn, turn on, on and, and off. off. The second is for temperature. And the last one is just for drains. And that's it for the bathroom. Now let's go look at the rest of the hotel room. Okay, so after you come out, there is a humongous closet. It's just something regular that you'll see often in hotel rooms. It's just a normal closet. Regular closet. Continuing on down the hallway, the ceilings are very tall. It's tall, yeah, definitely. This mirror, it's full length cool. size. I think more than full length. Yeah. It's really tall compared to my size. This is VD standing. And all the way off of there is where the mirror ends. That's, That's crazy. That's crazy. And then there's my suitcase. That's Drew's suitcase and her clothes for tomorrow. The thing about this room is that it's very cold. So we had to set the temperature to 72 degrees Fahrenheit. And we changed the setting so we can see in Fahrenheit. Because yeah. we don't know anything in Celsius. They had it in Celsius. Here are my clothes for tomorrow. And this is my backpack. I love this backpack. It's my favorite. So this is like a little place, I don't consider it a bench, I think that's where you put your outfits. It's like basically just I mean, a storage not compartment. I'm so sorry guys, I said outfit, your suitcase. Down here there's just storage, I think they, they the put some serves coffee and stuff. And continuing on, we have this nice long like two-in-one table desk thing, which I really like. It saves up space. This beautiful chair and this mirror as well. Um, I like it a lot. <laughs> Once you look here, there's a beautiful lamp. Wang, have my like stuff. Stuff, yeah, stuff. Hair comb, An empty bottle. game bottle, oranges, and telephone, and a TV. You're this TV it. is huge. I've never seen that big of a TV. Yeah, and it's just awkwardly placed up there. But um, let's continue on. Moving on, we had this like nice little sit and like i feel like dine yeah and sit like and you dine can just like drink your coffee there's a little watch lamp. the view behind you they yes just close the curtains there's not a good view, view it's below. just a building <laughs> once you move here you have this nice bed I think it's like a queen, queen size queen. and then the other is a twin queen size, size bed VD really claims the big bed and I guess I'll clean the small bed. So VD moves around a lot when she sleeps, so I guess yeah. that's fair. And obviously, I don't want to fall off the bed, so <laughs> that's just for my safety. The, she's the younger sibling; she gets what she wants. <laughs> um, so let's take a look at these nightstand. This is the nightstand. You have Cheez Its, a breakfast, or like a little snack from the airplane. You have this like little bag, skincare bag. Skincare bag. We have these waters. This one's from the plane. It's so yeah, cute. It's so cute and, and it's like refreshing. It was really nice and cool. It was nice drinking that water off the plane. Yeah. Pool. And then I just have my phone charger. Excuse that. There's mm -hmm. some drovers too. Yeah. And on our bed, we have our iPads that we were using earlier. <laughs> Over here, there's another little thing. We don't have anything. I just put my Apple Watch to charge. These it's cute little lamps. Yeah, they're like really cute. That's basically it for the whole room tour. We had a little lamp in the corner and whatever. And we also have the tall ceilings and just like everything. It doesn't feel enclosed. Yeah, yeah, it definitely feels like really nice and spacious and everything. I like spacious stuff. Well, thank you guys for watching Vivi's hotel room tours. So come subscribe me later. All right guys, so now I'm gonna quickly go brush and we'll show you our skincare like always. We did have an updated skincare routine, so yes. shall we show them? Yeah, let's go. All right guys, so I'm gonna do my skincare, but Vidi already finished hers early um, because I was gonna wear skincare, but Vidi already finished it. I forgot about that, so. I'm gonna start off with my cleanser. I feel like a real authentic skincare person because I have my nails done. Okay, I think it's time to rinse. Oops, I gotta grab my towel. Oh, 
was dripping water everywhere. <laughs> Half the face, but we all know no one really falls that way. So now that my face is all cleansed, washed, I'm going to be taking my moisturizer. I think I'm done. I'm going to put on some lip treatment. I'm back at my bed again, and so my lip treatment was in my little bag. So that's my whole skincare routine. Yeah, I'm gonna quickly use the bathroom and then we're gonna head to bed. All right guys, and that is the end of this vlog. It is vlog two here and it's officially over. Are you guys excited for the next vlog or the series at all? Comment down below. In our next vlog, we will be doing like an official tour day and that's when the whole vacation really comes to a start. So don't forget to subscribe, like, share, and hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on any other videos that we post. Bye for now and we hope you enjoyed this video.